this is a special dedication out to all my family and friends. Come on, wow. Let's do it again, bad and show. I said we all gonna go. <laughs> What's up, everybody, man? Look, before I even say what I got to say, I'm going to let y'all know right now, starting tonight, going into August, the name of this show will be different. It will not be the Let's Do It Again show. The name of my show now is the Tom Mo Show. All right? That's the new name. Let's do it again, bang. Got so much going on. I wanted to kind of, you know, give it some room, give me some room, because I got a whole lot planning that I'm going to be uh, into coming up. What's up? Is that Johnson? What's happening? Look. Y'all already know I got to give y'all something, man, before we really get into the show. And um, every Wednesday, man, I be, like, doing my daily stuff and all that. And I be, like, trying to figure out what is it that I need to share with the public when I come in tonight. Now, I got some friends. They like to go out, party, sip, you know, do their thing. And I be trying to encourage them to be conscious, be cautious of what they're doing. Because the life we live, 
we create it. We create our circumstances in our lives. And when we see people headed in the wrong direction, we can warn them. Not meaning that they're they going to listen, but we can warn them. We can give them heads up like, hey, look, I kind of see where you're going with this thing. I done seen it before. And, you know, you know, just because I have the love of God in my heart, I'm just trying to tell you, maybe you need to kind of slow down. I had a situation like that. That's the reason I'm talking about it. And they kind of make it, they try to make it seem like I was kind of like coming down on them, talking about them, ragging on them. And I was trying to explain to them, nah, it's not that. It's not that. For me to be a friend to you, I need to be able to tell you the truth. Even when you can't see it, even when you can't see it, I need to be able to tell you the truth because I am your friend. You got a lot of people around you. I see you ready to crash and burn and won't say nothing. I don't consider that a friend. I don't consider that a friend. If you see that I'm headed down the wrong road or something like that and you my friend, you a truly friend of mine, then you need to be able to talk to me. You need to be able to, good or bad, you need to be able to say, man, hey, look, man, what you're doing, man, that ain't going to work, man. I'm trying to tell you I've seen it before, and I think you need to kind of think about what you're doing, you know, pull yourself together, get it together. But when do people understand? When do people just understand that, man, you know, everybody's not bad. Everybody don't have a, bad agenda for your life when they're trying to tell you something good. Just kind of ponder on that for a little bit, man, because I'm quite sure y'all got some friends out there, man, that y'all done ran into situations like that, man. But they just try to make me feel like, man, I was talking about them. I was trying to talk them down. I'm talking against them and all that. And I was like, nah, man, it ain't like that. I'm just saying, man, what you doing, man? One day you're going to crash and burn, and it's going to destroy your life. And me being your friend, I don't want to see that happen to you. So this is the only reason why I'm coming to you with it and letting you know. All right. So now let's get on to the show, 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 show. All right. Now, the month of August, very, very busy. Last week, y'all already know, man, um, I had Miss Officer Nicole on the show uh, because we have this... Uh, Coming up, Power, uh, Blainsburg Road. That's where the club at. We're going to do some comedy, and we're going to have some artists, man, that, you know, come out and share some music and some songs. Let's Do It Again Band is not playing. This is about Geeking for Success is sponsoring this particular program. We got tickets. I tried to sell some tickets last week. Nobody called in for the tickets. I'm really not thinking about trying to do that again today, but I don't know. Second half, I may change my mind. You never know. But this is going to be the first time that we actually try this to see how it goes. And this, the space is, is not real big. So if you ain't already got some tickets, you know, all I know is when you get to the door, man, if there's no space to get in there, then you, ain't, you just ain't ready to get in. So that's why when I was giving away them free tickets last week, y'all should have grabbed them. Y'all should have been on it. But um, it's going to be real nice. It's going to be real nice, man. Um, we're going to have celebrities walking through all night. Of course, I'm going to be there. You know, I'm a celeb. Y'all already know that I'm going to be there. Uh, but it's going to be a nice event, man. And I would like for you, you know, if you can, come on out. That's August the 16th. It's going to start around about 9, 30, 10 o'clock. Come on out there, man, and party with it. It's an all-white event, red carpet. So, you know, we're going to jazz it up. We want you to come out and look real nice, man. We had a picture, picture booth and all that, you know. And just come out and enjoy yourself. Now, let me tell you what's coming up. Let me put my eyeballs on. On August the 3rd, we got Kenilworth Day. They're going to have some bands over there, cook out, a lot of stuff for the kids to play, moon bounce, all kinds of snow cones. They do it every year. 
That's going to be August the 3rd, and it starts at 1 o'clock. But the performance with the bands going to start around about 4. And, and, from, and from what I know, uh, I just had the, uh, they just sent it to me, but it's going to be four bands. Uh, Prophecy Band, Let's Do It Again Band, uh, Vintage Band and Show, and there's another, a new band. I really don't want to say new because they played last year, but I'm not really familiar with them, and I don't have the uh, paper in front of me, so. I don't want to do the guessing game and try to guess what it is. Um, and then after that, that following weekend, on the 10th of August, we're going to be playing on Georgia Avenue Day. Ron, did you hear about that? What's the name of that, uh, that park? Because it's a park, right? It's a park. But it's, it's, uh, it's straight up Georgia Avenue. If you go on Facebook, uh, Instagram, I'm quite sure it's already posted because you got all the bands going to be out there, man. We talking about Pump Blenders, Junkyard Band, uh, Bella Donna, uh, Familiar Faces. I mean, Let's Do It Again Band, you know, and a whole host of other, other groups, man. It's going to be an all-day affair. Uh, it's going to start at 12 with us. Let's do it again, bang, gonna kick it off at 12 o'clock. Now that night, we got a private event that we're gonna be doing that I really can't close with you all because it's a private event. Then on August the 17th, the one and only Vox Wave is having this uh, cookout. Yeah, the book, book bag, drive uh i mean this joint gonna be off the chain he gonna have everything out there man i'm talking about he loved doing the cookout he loved cooking and grilling and all that so it's gonna be fun for the kids and everything y'all see it up there man i just need y'all to uh if you ain't doing nothing come and just you know bring the kids because that's what it's about it's about sharing it with the kids you know it's an annual celebration that's going to be on the 17th of August, man. What what time that's going to kick off, uh, Ron? You know? Wait, I can't see. Okay, 4 o'clock. 4 o'clock is going to start. And 9 out of 10, let's do it again, band. It's going to be the opening band. We're going to be the opening band for that event. Then I got something planned for the 24th, but it's not confirmed yet, so I'm not going to even, you know, put it out there. Once they call me back and confirm it within the next couple of weeks, then I'll let y'all know uh, maybe next week or something. But then on the 30th of August, we're going to be down in Fuse, right there on Allentown Road with uh, Vintage Band and Show. We're going to be down there, man, partying with them. Of course, the door's going to open, man, 9.30, man. Y'all get in there, man, and uh, we're going to open up, and, and Vintage Band going to end it. Uh, I had an invite to go to West Virginia on the 4th of August. They having a family and friends day down there, and they're going to have a lot of stuff going on, man. And the guy called me uh, to uh, be a part of that, man. But it, it's the, the finances is just not available for us to take that trip. So I think we're going we gonna to kind of miss that one. Uh, not yet something changed between now and in the next couple of days, we on we we'll roll down there. Um, but geeking for success, man, geeking for success is a nonprofit organization, and they're here to help the community, man. You know, try to give these youth things to do, something to do. I'm saying this thing is so deep. I don't want to get too much up because, like, they're going to be here uh, momentarily. But it's like, man, we're trying to give kids jobs. You know, we're trying to open the doors to give kids jobs. We're trying to open the doors for your uh, talent, whatever talent you may have. We're trying to open those doors. 
and we're trying to blend with other places like New York, North Carolina, South Carolina, Georgia, L.A., Vegas. You know, we're trying to make this thing, man, joyful. But I'll talk more about that when when uh, uh, they get here. Uh, my man, uh, D. Eagle, that's my man, man. We partners, uh, and sometimes it gets stressful, man. But we we gonna push forward. We gonna push forward, man. Uh, I want to give a shout out, man, to uh, the Congo Isle for last night performance, man, and the guests that they had on their show last night, man. Um, they was doing it, man. DJ Rick, man, he, he man, he got all the way down, man. You know what I mean? But they had uh, a special guest, man, uh, an OG, man, that was explaining how all this music and and shows and all this stuff began um, back in the '70s, because he was a part of that. Um, Ron, ain't no flies for for the upcoming event that they got coming. They had some flies in here last night. Did they take them all out? Yeah, but uh, anyway, I wanted to share it with y'all. Uh, I know it's an annual, uh, I don't know if it's an art festival or something like that, um, but I know there's a whole lot of bands going to be a part of it. Oh, Anthony Hammond supposed to be playing on this particular show. Um, I already know Backyard supposed to be on it. But I just know it's gonna be a, a nice event, man. Uh, and the guys say he, they they do it like once a year. Um, so, but shout outs to y'all, man, for that information that y'all uh, gave us last night. And um, hey, what was that band? He had a band on uh, a group of young guys, man, brothers, man, dynamite brothers. They've been in the music industry, man, for years. They come from all walks of life, man. But they got this new song out that. Uh, Michael Jackson uh, wrote uh, the Twitter Elite. They they kind of did a mix with that joint. That joint was banging. It was banging. You ain't hear it, Ron? Yeah, Rock and Robin. Yeah. Oh, who wrote that? Twitter Elite. Man, I swore that was Michael Jackson, man. Okay, okay. Well, see, I'm, I'm only going by what I know. So I know Michael Jackson did hit that. And these young brothers, man, they took that thing and, and put that go-go on there, that bounce beat, man, and that thing doing a whole nother flavor. But they did all that last night right here on Vox Wave Live, man. They did it, man. You know what I mean? I tuned in. I watched it. I enjoyed it. I actually came up here, man, to, uh, to kind of meet the guys a little bit. So shout out to y'all, man. Keep doing what y'all doing. And what I'm going to do right now, man, I'm going to go to a quick break, man, and uh, pay some bills, man. And I'll be right back at y'all, man, real soon. All right, see you in a moment. Whenever uh, Ron gets ready. That's right, it's me again, the one and only man. My name is Thomas Bartley. Go by the, AKA Tom Mo. Look, come and see me, man, on foxwave.com. We're talking every Wednesday from 9.30 to 10.30. You gotta be there. I got a lot to talk about. It's up to you. See you soon. Do it again, bang. Come on down here, y'all. Each and every Thursday. I don't know when the next time, but uh, I know this Thursday we down at Tacoma Station. That's Tonight. right. Let's do it again, bang. Get here, bang. That's right. We down here Thursday night with Pump Blenders. We got an all white coming up, man. We all need to come out here and do this with us, man. Hey, right. Tell a little bit about Tom O's show, man. Oh, yeah, Tom O's show is great. But if anything else, come and see me play keys. Forget okay. everyone else. <laughs> <laughs> y'all tune in to Box Wave. Box, every, yes. Every Wednesday night from 9.30 to 10.30. Box Wave, let's do it again, let's do it man. Again. Show. Man, right. matter of fact, don't forget, come and see Dave, too. Yeah, come see me. <laughs> Man, I got the 
But look, my guest just got here. So, Ron, we're going we, we gonna, to we gonna run back a, a quick commercial, a quick song, man, where we can get them settled in. And then I'll be back with y'all at the Tom Mo Show. See you in a minute. We're going to do this for y'all, man. A little something we put together. Huh? It's called U.I.A. What's up? I'm here to tell you straight up about the music, the part you don't understand. We talk about let's do it again, bang. And again, and again, and again, for your listening pleasures, to make sure we hit your fancy, so you can do your dance. Yeah, I'm the guitar player, so let's do it again, group. And I love to just make people laugh. So just come on down in your time, your spare time, and I guarantee you, it won't be bad. You will, definitely will make you don't feel sad when you hit those chords, and you be doing your little moves, and you get your little dance together, and then it's all over. <laughs> Hey, what's up? This twin with the last doing again band doing it with Big Mo and them tonight at the Tacoma Station. You know, we're gonna have a nice little little party, make it work for Mo and, and let's do it again. So y'all come on out and come on here this funky sound that uh let's do it again got with Mo and the boys. When I'm out. Hey, welcome back to the Tom Mo Show. That's right, y'all know that's the new name going into August, man. It's no longer gonna be Let's Do It Again Band and show. It's going to be the Tom Mo Show, and we're going to work that out. We got our guests here. We got the one and only Ghost. What's going on? What's and on this side, that? we got the one and only Queen Miss Destiny. Destiny. I call it Destiny Child. You know what I mean? I like to work that. <laughs> but look, though, this is the real Geeking for Success family. This is what this is today, man. Y'all know how I've been talking about Geeking for Success. I've been promoting Geeking <coughs> for Success. Well, this is what you call the glue and the sticks coming together. This is the real team. This is the real deal. It ain't just me by myself no more. See, I got everybody here with me, man. We're going to go over some stuff. But before we get started, I want to just uh, send a shout out to DDA. We, we went down to the Girls and Boys Club last, uh, was that Saturday? Yeah, yeah last Saturday uh, to uh, support um, uh, 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 Pure, Solar. Pure Solar. Yeah, Pure Solar. And uh, we had a table, man. Uh, Geeking for Success had a table, man. We had everything out there, man. I'm talking about it looked real nice. You can go on. Uh, we the link one and see the, the footage if you like to see the footage if you like um, We met a lot of good people that was down there doing stuff. They was giving away a lot of stuff, man I mean, you know the only only 
kind of issue I pretty much had was that I don't think it was uh, promoted out into the city right because it wasn't enough kids out there. And it was for the kids. And, and that's one thing about Gigging for Success. We're going to make sure we got the youth in the building. When we do something for the youth, we're going to make sure they're in the building because that's what it's about. It's about the youth, the new wave. Now, let me get over here to Miss Destiny. And let's see what's her involvement. Let's talk. How you feel tonight, Destiny? I'm good. You feel good? You had a good day today? Yes. Yes, they was marvelous, marvelous until it started drizzling. You know what I mean? How about you, Ghost? How you how you feel, man? I've been good. I've been, been good? Been man, you know, God is good, man. It's, All the time. You know, I'm always trying to uh, work, man. But then again, I got a man that's driving me, man. Like, you know what I'm talking about? You know, the Eagle, man, he don't be playing, man. It's like, man, it's work, work, work. And no play. When you got time to play, that means you ain't doing something right. That's correct. But that's how we motivate each other, man, to keep going. Okay. Okay. So, um, so Destiny, um, how old are you, if I can ask? Seventeen. Seventeen. Y'all see that? A young lady, ready to put the work in. So, where you from? Maryland. What part of Maryland? District Heights. District Heights. District Heights, Maryland, man. You know what I'm saying? So, so, what year did you actually come up with this uh, Geeking for Success? I must say it's the summer of 2017. I remember one day I was in my room, and mm -hmm. then my brother, you know, y'all call him D Eagle, don't call him that, but he came and got me out of my room. He was like, come sit on the front porch with me. Right. And we started talking, and he told me about it, and I was like, I like the idea, and we, you know, was going since then. But, but I, I need you to kind of just a little bit, not too much, to just, mm -hmm. what is your ideas about Geeking for Success? We originally started it for young women but I told him we could involve young men too. Mm -hmm. um, I think it's because he had, you know, team motivation and all that for men, but geeking for success was for young women, you know, you know, less fortunate maybe, or mm -hmm. can't mm -hmm. do something. We are there to help them out. You know, the little things, maybe get their hair done for school, stuff like that. School supplies, new shoes, just mm -hmm. giving back to the, you know, community. And what, but what made you feel this? I mean, like, because you're only 17 now, and you're saying y'all been doing this way before now, so what gave you that inspiration to just want to reach out to the public like that? I say, you know, pub, being in public schools, you see a lot of different things. Mm -hmm. You know, people get bullied for being less fortunate, mm -hmm. having dirty clothes and stuff like that, mm -hmm. and it's, it's like, you can't do nothing about it unless you, you know, try. And seeing stuff like that, it was just like, yeah, something got changed. Oh, man, man. She she got she got real deep with me on that thing there, man, because, like, that's a whole other segment to get into with the bully and things like that. But just for you to have the heart to want to just, you know, make a difference in some other unfortunate you know, youngins growing up lies, man. That, that, that's a lot. That's a lot, man. Let's give our hand for Destiny, man. Just, just because, man, she got that love of God, cause that's where that come from. That ain't something you just get off the street. You know what I mean? But let's come over here to my main man. You understand me? Because you know we can ready to do power on August the 16th. August 16th. And we all of us know that who is the main star in power on TV, huh? <laughs> Huh? Ghost, man. Ghost. So we have the one and only DC Ghost right here. How you been, man? I've been great. How Look, get, I, what I want you to do is just kind of give the listeners, man, of like what, what's your role with, with uh, Geeking for Success, We The Link, you know what I mean? I always call them the bad boys. What's their real names? The, um, two, two, good two good men. I always call them the bad boys because they be tearing it down. Well, with them, um, you can say, you can basically say I'm the A and R for the company, so, and I deal with the social media, 
And then when you say and R and R for which company? The one, yeah. we link yeah, one. You can find that on uh, at one. O N E underscore D M V. And then you say you you did you say you was the spokesman also? Yeah, I mean I, I'm not I'm not too much camera friendly, but um, I do I do right. speak to a lot of um, right right. Gentlemen I, I, in the I background. Know from one. This is one, established. one nation established. Okay, one nation established. Now when did you start all this? You know, far as you in this in this business. Five years ago. Five years ago? So how you like it? It's a rough, rough road. Yeah. It's, it's always worth the um, effort. Right. It's not easy. Because let me, let me give y'all a quick story, man, about Ghost, man. Me and Eagle was, you know, having our normal day, you know, because this is my partner. We get together every day, okay? We riding around. We taking care of some business, man. We talking about how we going to do this, how we going to do that. And then we get a call. Or I don't know if uh, Ghost called Eagle or Eagle called Ghost. But I know he had something going on up George, George Avenue. Next thing I know, boom, okay. Yeah, man, I go DJ. They need a DJ up there, man. I do it. He got a cookout. He got the cameras up there. They doing the joint. Man, 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 Eagle gets in the car, man. I get all my equipment, man. We rolls up here. When we get up there, who do we see? No Ghost. <laughs> ghost ain't even there. They got the grill going. They, <laughs> I'm saying, man, I'm looking at Eagle and I'm like, Slim. <laughs> I'm, I'm like, I'm like, Slim, did we just ride all the way up here through traffic and I can't even plug up, man? But, man, I'm just saying, man, it's, 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 and that, that's just say that just to say that your life, man, be busy. And you be doing the right things, but sometimes you got to get called off. You gone to the radio station. You, you know what I'm saying? So what's new going on with you, though? Tell us that. What's new going on with you? Um, well, obviously, um, August 16th, we have Power Life Club, Northeast. Shout out to um, Eagle, Jose, Jose Ross, good brother there. Um, shout out to um, everybody that's involved in that project there. But um, most of the projects that we have coming up is mainly with... Um, artist named Young Show and okay. the Eagle uh -huh. is what I'm focusing on at the moment. Oh, okay. As an artist individually. Um, right, so right. So uh, Young Show, he has a project that just launched with Pee Wee Longway and mm -hmm. Old Murder GD, mm -hmm. and it's called Bachata with the Chopper. Oh, okay. And it's been doing numbers. The video should be released soon. Um, okay. But it can go on. It's on all major platforms. Yeah, right, right, okay, okay. Um, but we uh, mainly focusing on today uh, is the 16th. That's right. Um, what we're going to do is get an opportunity for a few, uh, artists to have their music listened to by DJ, uh, DJ Rail and while it's getting on his mixtape, he'll uh, decide to say that you um, want to get on his mixtape. You got to pick and choose who you want. Okay. So we are doing everything for those and also other entities that's um, available for independent artists. Right, right. Man, y'all hear that, man? It's, it's a lot going on, man, with uh, Geeking for Success, man, along with all the other attachments that goes with it. You know what I mean? And if, uh, 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 if you are interested, uh, how can they reach you? I don't want you to pass out up here, man. Nah, nah, you know what I'm saying? Because I know man. that talking, that, that'll do it. Because I remember I was up here a couple of weeks ago, and Ron ain't had me no water, man. I was up this joint, dry tongue, dry neck, and everything. You but know yeah. what I mean? But, yeah, um, you can also uh, reach me at happyhourspotlight at gmail.com. Um, the management team for Young Show is Book Young Show, SPL at gmail.com. Um, 
make sure y'all go to our website that we just launched. Um, it's Geeking for Success with one C. Mm-hmm. So make sure you look that up, www.geekingforsuccess. Well, I hope y'all can hear Ghost Man, because I, I better get him up here. But he got a mic going, so I hope it's... Yeah, what'd you say, Auntie? Yeah, because well, yeah, I'm speaking up, I don't, I don't, I'm very soft spoken. Yeah, he's very soft spoken, man, man. Excuse me. But what we'll do before we we uh, end the show, we're gonna go back over and he can give y'all all that information to go on how to be able to reach him and how to get in contact with maybe if you're interested in, in, in trying to be signed, you try and get on the label, you try and get on the show, you know. Um, I most definitely, man, um, appreciate. Uh, you coming tonight, man, because I know you're a busy man, and you already know, Destiny, I'm glad this is my first time meeting you, and you already know we're going to be working side by side, hand in hand, because we got to get this thing off the ground. Geeking for Success got to get off the ground. We got to, you know, we got to we gotta hit the streets with both feet running, you know what I mean? And with your inspiration, your admiration, I mean, it's like you going to be the head center. Because, see, we done got old. We done got old, man. It's about the, the ones that's coming up now. And that's and that's what's important. Like, you know, who knows? You may be our next mayor. You may be our next president. That, that kind of thing now that we done had Obama, we know it can happen. Because I know when I was growing up, I was always told we would never have a black president. And I believe that. So when Obama won... I looked at my mom like, man, I thought you said we'd never have a black president, man. This man up in there now. So anything is possible. But we got to teach our youth. We got to teach them. We got to direct them. And we got to help the ones that can't help themselves. And that's where you're going to play a big part at. Believe that. Now, um, what what is the next thing for, uh, or the next, what I want to say, what is the next plans for Geeking for Success? Um. Me, my brother, and my mom was sitting down the other day Mm -hmm. talking about the vision boards, getting donations. The what board? Vision boards. Because I need you to talk up a little bit. Don't be (laughs) like ghosts over here. Vision boards. um, Vision boards is just like our plans for the future. Do we have a vision board? Did we bring one? No, we did not. See a collage on the wall here in the box? Yeah. There will be in her perspective vision board, but she's going to be able to break down mm-hmm. what Geeking for Success has done <coughs> okay. since 2017. Okay. Even the story she told earlier, she right. surprised me because... Ron, can I get, can I get him on, 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 on No, no, keep going, though. Keep going. No, Ron, going. get him on it. And when she... Yeah, yeah, see, we... we no, uh-uh, you need, need that. Need that. need that. Did you hear anything he said out there, Auntie? Okay, all right. Well, she know you, though. Okay. Not not real quick. Give me one moment. Let my man get you together over there, man. Because we like to do things right here at Vox Wave at the Tom Mo Show. That's right. I love that there. <laughs> yes, indeed, it, man. Yeah, man. We're going to step this thing up, man. We're going to step it up, man, especially now when we do power, man. I'm going to have my little microphone, man, with the... the uh, let's do it again. Band sign on that joint like I'm Channel Five. The logo on the uh, on the new uh, the logo. The Let's do it again. Band logo. Yeah, yeah, it's up there. It's up there when it when it when it, when it come back. You'll see that new logo. They got it up there. We need them logo sales, man. We need them logo. Sales. Most definitely. Now we need to uh, we need to get put the the eagle on the. There we go. Now, kind of explain about the vision board uh for us, please. Well, back to what Destiny was saying. Uh, I was making an example of the uh, the pictures of the collages that's on the wall in the mm-hmm. walkway. Right. Her perspective of her vision is, and ours too, because it's, it's broken in twos. Mm-hmm. It's hers and it's ours. Right. She's going to explain, uh, you know, the, the grind from 2017 <clears throat> all the way until now. And then, like I was saying, she shocked me when she mentioned how I even introduced the idea to her. Mm-hmm. Because she was on my mind. It's like I watched... I watch her and a few other young young uh, kings and queens that I'm around. I sponge them right. and see how I could put that into my old movements until currently. Right. So just bringing it up to her and when we when we plan to do what we're doing, the vision board is what she's saying. is like she's going to break it down, man, until 
then now, mm -hmm. and the plans of, of, of her being a visionary, mm -hmm. future-wise. So, so when, when is we gonna <clears throat> be able to get get the vision board here on the show? Well, right now we're working on a, uh, just dates. Mm -hmm. We're working on because you know we like to work like just dates, so mm -hmm. you'll know what you're targeting, mm -hmm. what you're attacking, and mm -hmm. you know, man, baby girl, going moves, man. Mm -hmm. It's our move right, right here to make right. sure it's it's calculated right. So right. you know, I'm happy to be here because. It's the Geek and for Success team now. Right, you right. You know what I'm saying? It's, 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 it's coming, though. If I yeah, can just say that, yeah, it's coming. And yeah. then by you sponsoring yeah, us, yeah. Uh, that's a good that's a good yeah. look for the future. Right, right. Go shout out to, uh, man, we the link, like you say, everything. Right, <laughs> right, right, man. Yeah, man. You and everybody lot. else behind it's everything, man. I appreciate, so. I appreciate the team, man. Yeah, well, you know what, man? We, we appreciate you. We appreciate destiny vision yeah, yeah 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 you know what i mean because we don't have man like i was telling you uh earlier today they had a a, a gentleman a og on here last night man that was pretty much mm -hmm. not did it like you all doing it now but he did it he had the concern of the community and that thing took him a whole a whole nother life man you know what i mean mm -hmm. and and if y'all you know if you if you want to know what i'm talking about just go to uh vox wave uh, last night's show and uh, view it and he, he'll tell you you know how he started out and he started out with the visions and he started out in the schools just like the uh, gig for success calendars you know what I'm saying y'all got a product that's mainstream but in order for gig for success we the link DC Power Brokers. Power brokers. Mm -hmm. I had, I had yeah, that joint. Sony Records, uh, Boo Boo the Fool, man. One of the hottest producers. Okay, okay. DC. You know what I mean? Yeah. In order for all this to work, man, we all got to put our work in. Right. We all got to put our work in. We can't get discouraged. That's that's what I don't want. And I said I don't want her to really go through this life. She's going to go through a lot of things. But I don't want her to really be trying to help people and being hindered. <clears throat> right, right. It's right. You know, know, I know. That. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, like Joe yeah. said earlier, it's, we know what it takes, man. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But I'm not gonna sit here and tell her that the stove not hot neither. Right, you right, know what right, 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 so right, right. Right. I I love my sister Vision just because right, now right. I don't have to look at her as my sister. I can look at her as just another human with a vision. That's we, right. That's we right. Work from there. So Destiny, how you feel about all that? About just, just you know, like, cause it's like for real. The way I'm, I'm, I'm feeling right now is like we just gonna take this whole bag of water and just pour it on you, and it's just gonna be up to you to make this thing do. How you feel about that? <laughs> how you feel about that? I mean, I don't let nothing get me down. I can right? take all the weight, and I mean, if I do need help, I call for help. But for the most part, I think. I'm a, I got it. Okay, okay. Uh -huh. I like that confidence. Now, look, what we're going to do, we're going to take a quick break, man, pay some bills. We want to do that boogie shoes, man, because we most definitely pushing that definitely for this 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 uh this year to uh definitely. put your boogie shoes on because Destiny got her boogie shoes on. Eagle got his boogie shoes on. And what's his <laughs> name again? Ghost. Yeah. The ghost off of the real ghost got his boogie shoes on, man. So we just going to continue to uh push this. Uh, uh, gigging for success. Let's do it again, band. We the link. DC Power Brokers. Finally got that joint. Good God of mine. <laughs> we gonna keep on pushing this, man, until we do what God got inside us to do. We'll be right back. We're gonna take a quick break and uh, boogie shoes with it.
what's up? That's right, it's me again, the one and only man. My name is Thomas Bartley. Go by AKA Tom Mo. Look, come and see me, man, on foxway.com. We're talking every Wednesday from 9.30 to 10.30. You gotta be there. I got a lot to talk about. It's up to you. See you soon. We love. We love. All right, all right, all right. We back. Come on, put our hands together, man, for our guest tonight. That's outstanding. If you're just joining us, you are now listening to the Tom Mo Show. That's right. I changed it. If you ain't know it, I changed it. <laughs> yeah. But look, we here, man, with, with the Geeking for Success whole team. We got the manager out on the outside. She out there chilling. <laughs> we, we'll get her in here the next time, maybe. But we got Destiny here, which she is most definitely the head of Geeking for Success because she is the youth that's going to pull it all together. Then we got our partner here, Ghost, man, straight out of power. Don't forget it. Straight off of power. Y'all know Ghost was wicked, too, man. Yeah, fuck Ghost, man. But uh, but this is a different ghost. This is a good ghost right here. I ain't saying that ghost ain't bad or good either. But I don't know, because Ghost Job did some things on them shows. You hear me? <laughs> got to watch Ghost over here. <laughs> got the wrong name at the wrong time. But anyway, <laughs> uh, we got Ghost Man over here, man. I'm saying, man, you know, this man is, is most definitely busy. Then we got my man D Eagle, man, sitting right there, man, the one and only man. It's like it's like Slim in his own in his own way, man. He's like a genius, man, in his own way. Nah, and I'm man. telling y'all that because I'm with him every day. I'm with him every day. And when we be talking, man, he be getting so deep with it. Like I'm like, man, we're gonna be rich. <laughs> we're gonna get rich out this joint, man, if everything go the way it's supposed to go, man. But that's everybody's dream. You know what I'm saying? That's idea, but man, I just wanna uh Thank you all, man, for coming here tonight, man, and, and just sharing, you know, where we going, what we trying to do, because if we don't do it, who going to do it? Who going to do it? But I want to send this out to, to everybody that's listening and watching. We need funds. Could y'all please understand that? We need funds. That's true. Nothing that, that can happen just by verbally talking about it. And if you are willing to help fund the community, because it's not going in my pocket, it's not going in Destiny pocket, it's not going in Ghost pocket, it's not going to the Eagle pocket, and it's not going to the manager of the whole operation pocket. It's going back into the community. They just had at the Boys and Girls Club a whole thing down there just passed, and it was probably 10 kids in the whole building. They had food and everything. They had gifts. They was giving away uh, uh, iPads, I mean, to the kids. So that means if they had brought, let's say they brought 20 iPads, only three kids got them. And I'm saying, man, I, I mean, I was really frustrated with that, man. I was really frustrated. But we met some good people. You know what I'm saying? We talked to some good people. And, and, and we're going to network with them people that we talked to. But I'm saying off the real and no, you know, keeping it 100, man, we need some people, man, to donate some stuff. We need some people, man, to back us up, man. And if you're interested in doing that, how can how can they reach you, uh, Eagle? You can reach uh, the whole team at uh, Instagram, Geeking for Success, Facebook. The name speaks for itself. Uh, any 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 uh, major promotion, we the link one. Uh, like you said before, one underscore DMV. This is all Instagram, and if you can reach us at a 301-860-9966 for that physical conversation, consulting, talk game, everything to get you on board. And, and another thing too is what I love about uh, the operating officer vision is she did last year, <clears throat> along with the promo team, a comedy, a Mother's Day special event. Okay. The American Legion in District Heights, you know what I'm saying? And, uh, for her to be 17 now and to be able to put like comedians like Sean Nevison, Tony Spoon, and uh, Ed Edward Daniels together, you know what I'm saying? So that was a special event as well. She had uh, another uh, teammate of ours from Ohio, her name is uh, Bumby. So, like, 
I'm sitting behind the scenes and watching a lot of plays being made, and all I'm doing is, like I said, the geeking is the house, man. That's right. It's the new Disney. It's the new whatever you wanted to be. Right, but right. It's what you wanted to be. You that's right. That's so right. Like, that's, geeking that's is the umbrella. Doing it. Yeah. yeah. Because let's do it again. <laughs> Band is most definitely under geeking, man. And we most definitely, man, appreciate everything that they're doing for us, man. And um, that's you got some. You got some um, shout outs you want to give to some of your friends that may be watching or may look at this later? No. She ain't got no friends. She worked too the old, hard. The old 426. She, she worked too hard. She told me something. The old no. 426. That's what I'm here for. I got her. Okay, man. that's right. Her. What about you, Ghost? You got, got some her. shout outs you want to do before we roll out? Shout out to God, man. Oh, Ooh, man. That's, he got, so that's that ghost man. look. Man, you heard that, man? <laughs> Everybody know. Everybody already know they get their shout outs to me every day. I support right. everybody every day. That's right. There's no need to even what? throw out shout outs. Y'all know who y'all who I rock with. That's right. That's know. right. What about you, Auntie? You got some shout outs? Okay. Okay. Well, I'm gonna send a shout out, man, to the whole DMV. From me to you, the Tom O Show. From this time to the next time. Peace. See you next week. Oh my goodness, here we go again. Come on. I like to send a special dedication out to all my family and friends. Come on, wow. Let's do it again, band and show. I said we all must go.